Hello everyone, my name is Shalinda Chaudhary and in this video, I'll walk you through the step-by-step -step process of creating portfolio or profile. To create a portfolio, you don't have to register any domain or know how to create a website in HTML. It's very simple. I'll just quickly show you the recent portfolio which I have created. That's my portfolio. This is me. Ignore the image. I don't have a formal portfolio image, so I used the existing one. This is about me, my skills, the projects I have worked on, the work experience and different certifications I have. And this is publicly available. Anyone can access it so you can use within your organization or if you have to send it to someone, it's kind of a digital resume or CV. So to create this portfolio, I have used free templates which are available on different websites, but my favorite is free CSS. So I've used the portfolio template and used the GitHub pages to host my portfolio. So if I'll go to the GitHub pages, using the GitHub pages, you can host your website, static website, portfolios like I have done it, as well as the different blogs. So this is GitHub pages. I'll show all these processes in this video itself. First go to github.com and sign up. Once you have created an account, I have created an account with the name lab demo 2233 create a repo the name of the repo should be very specific first the name of the account lab demo 2233.github.io should be publicly available create repo it's done so now your repo is created let's get some free templates free portfolio templates Let's go to CSS. You can see there are 600 templates available. Let's pick any one template. Let's choose this one. You can click on live demo to see how your portfolio will look like. This looks good. All the work X, everything you can see here. So let's download this template. The template will be in the zip file. So you have to extract it. Let's extract the template. Good, it's done. Click on index.html and you can see your locally available page. So now let's make changes. I want to change the name from Kate to Shalinda. So let's go to the directory again. Open in any editor. So I'll open this in visual studio code let's search kate so instead of the kate i'll just provide my name which is shalinda chaudhary and save it let's go to the locally hosted page refresh it and you can see my name so as per your requirements you can make the changes in your portfolio or the website. So now second step is we'll host this website. Now the changes are done. Let's make this publicly available. Go to your repo. Upload an existing file. And go to the directory. Select all these files and drag and drop here. As you can see, there are around 60 files which are getting uploaded. It's a very easy process. So I'll pause the video now and resume once it's done. As you can see, all the files are ready to be uploaded. Commit the changes. And now you will see all your files in your repo. It's all done now. Let's go to labdemo2233.gifthub.io. The files are not reflecting yet. Sometimes it takes few minutes to reflect the changes. It took around five minutes and here you go. Your website is ready. So whenever you want to make changes, go to the repo, go to index.html and make your changes. So instead of 10 years experience, let's put 11 years. Click on edit. So let's make it 11. Commit changes. 
it will reflect in a minute or so and in case you want to upload the images or change the images this is an image folder and you have to change the images here and here you go you can see the changes here now it has 11 years of experience so as per your requirement you can make changes and create your profile or a blog you have to find the correct template and use it so that's it for this video hope you will like it please like and subscribe to my channel thank you bye bye